This one's just called Lost World. Even though it's clearly a fucking pyramid. But, yeah. Okay. Go to the... Oh. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Wow. For a game about going fast, you're sure going slow. What the... Why, why was he there? Yeah, hey, I got a gorilla. A gorilla. DK! Mm, don't keep... Oh, I, I really hate when Sonic has to slow down, like, right there. It's like, you're moving fast right here, and then, like, you gotta, and then, like, you know, you just instantly stop. Oh, there we go. Never mind, never mind. We picking up speed, baby. Nope. Oh! Oh, I know you saw that. Oh, 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 okay. Yeah, sure. Let's have fucking blocks stop you in your freaking path. I mean, the fireballs I like because you have to dodge them, but these things can just stop you and, like, make you lose all your momentum. It's complete bullshit. But, you know, we're not gonna... We're not here to complain. We're not here to complain. Of course, you know, you just you run into the to to Kel. Oh shit, no 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 no. We gotta get that checkpoint. I don't wanna start from the beginning of the fucking level because that would be bad. Very bad. Oh shit. Uh, what do you gotta say to me now to come? What? What? I gotta find three switches? That's some bullshit. I gotta find me some three fucking switches. This is, this is, really, that I didn't even know about, oh boy, okay, so, from what I'm guessing is we have to, obviously we're raising the water level, but, but then what else does that do, oh, okay, can you actually die in Sonic Adventure if you're under the water for too long? Also, I don't think, yeah, see, I'm very confused, uh, oh, we can use it to get to higher platforms, I think, right, yeah, I think this is one of the switch, switches, yep, okay, so next one, oh, oh, shit, okay, alright, and we, uh, made it, oh, oh, what the fuck is this? <laughs> okay, let's try that again. Oh my gosh. Okay, no, this narrow pathway shit is not good for a Sonic game. Oh gosh. No. Um. Oh, I gotta use the fucking mirror. I mean, again, I'm not. Always, I'm not implying that Sonic Adventure is a bad game. I think this is a classic. Um. Oh. Though I I can see like uh like because the thing about like Sonic Adventure so I mean I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and ramble because uh, usually when I do um you know let's plays um you know I I always like to ramble you know just to get a conversation going but um to me like some people like say that like this game is overrated um well in my personal opinion I do think it's a bit overrated it's it's not a bad Sonic game at least in my opinion. Um, I've been watching a few YouTubers learn about how Sonic was and how, like, Sonic just should have never made a jump to 3D. And even though I, I like, I disagree with it, um, I can, I can see people's point of view. Okay, then. Great. Uh, so, um, that happened. But, uh, anyways, as I was saying, like, people have stated that this game, or at least people said that this game is, like, a masterpiece, um... And even though, yeah, I do admit that it is an overrated game, again, it's not necessarily a bad game. Like, it, it has its flaws, like the, uh, homing attack, for an example. That really, that really, I don't even know what just happened. Like, that just straight up messed me up. But, um, anyways, as I was saying, um, the game is great for the most part. I mean, it controls well, and, like, that's, that's something coming from me, and I'm playing a f this on a freaking emulator, and it's, it's not easy playing anything on an emulator. In fact, it's quite frustrating, but, um, I don't know. I just think this game controls pretty well for what it is, and it does, it does have a lot of, uh, speeding sections, but, um, as I was saying earlier, though, is that, like, I've been reviewing a couple of YouTubers review about how Sonic Show never made a cut to 3D, um, which, it's debatable. I think that, uh, with the right mechanics and, like, you know, you know, the consistency and, like, you know, uh, t perfect timing and perfect execution, I think Sonic can make a good jump to 3D. Um, it takes patience, obviously, 
but I think that Sonic uh, would definitely make a good jump to 3D. I mean, we've gotten a few perfect examples already, like Sonic Generations, Sonic Colors, uh, this game, uh, Sonic Adventure 2. <laughs> well, like I said, this game has, like, a few flaws. Um, yeah. Oh my God, I really gotta do this all over again. Like, it's, it's really annoying, like, because, like, Sonic's momentum... Like, th like, this is when Sonic's momentum kind of fucks over, which is why, like I said, this game is a bit overrated, uh, because, um, it don't wrong, like, it provides, like, a great, it, it, prov it provides great speed, I like that, like, there's a lot of, like, acts in this game, like, I really did enjoy, um, I did enjoy, I really did enjoy, um, the speed, uh, Twinkle Park, I think it was called the Speed, Hi speed Highway, I think, uh, the one stage where, um, I think it was in episode 3, uh, uh, zone, uh, the ice cap was a good level in my opinion, because even though the first part of it is complete asinine, or not asinine, but it's like, it's complete, like, garbage, because, like, it's, it's just like, I mean, all you're doing is platforming, and if you mess up, like, one jump, it becomes very, <sighs> gosh, Sonic, please, why are you fucking up? Jeez Louise. I think a lot of, um, I think there's, like, a lot of, um, oh, that has rubber banding. Fucking awesome. But anyways, as I was saying, like, as I was saying, like, like, um, I think Sonic does work well in, like, 3D, like, um, well, it's, it's not, it's not the best. Like, Adventure 1 and 2 is not the best. Like, I, I do think that so the speed sections are still a bit flawed. It, it, it's it's very minor and I and I can still enjoy the game at least in my personal opinion. Yes, it is an under overrated because like this these aren't the best 3D Sonic games of all time. I mean, I personally think Colors in, at least in terms of gameplay is better than Adventure One and Two. But as for the story for Colors, it was very cheesy and compared to this game, like I really do miss the old Sonic's like tone of the games. Like even though like games like Shadow and like um, and like um. Unleashed and Black Knight were complete ass in terms of gameplay, along with Secret Rings. A lot of people really appreciated the tone, and I was one of those fans. I mean, I don't, I wouldn't even really mind the cheesiness in a Sonic game. In fact, that's kind of like, it's kind of like the appeal for modern Sonic nowadays, so. I just have problems with the, um. Oh, that was a close one. Oh my god. I don't know how I survived that, but... Anyways, as I was saying, like, I really do miss the, like, old tone of Sonic games and stuff. I just... Like, I really do. Um, but, like I said, like, I, I don't think that, like, the cheesy cutscenes are bad. In fact, I, it kind of has some charm to it. And, like, I don't... And, like, I, I, I like charm in video games, you know? It, it, it kind of makes up for more memories. Like, yeah, no copyright law in the universe is gonna stop. Like, yeah, that is a really stupid and, and, like, really cringy line. But at the same time, I can really appreciate it. Because it, you know, it, it can be very memorable. What the heck? Alright, uh... Oh. Go! I like... I like the spin dash section, though. I think that's really cool. Oh! Yeah, I think we made it. Nice! We did it. We completed it. I know. I, I know. I kind of sound a bit more cheery than more. Oh, thank you, game. Once again, I'm just an incel cuck. But anyways, um, I know I sound a bit more um cheery than I do in my last episodes, and that's mainly because of my last episodes. I was like extremely tired, but I think I'm uh, in a cheery mood today. Ah, it shows chaos. Oh boy. Oh. Oh boy. <laughs> what was that facial expression? Really weird. Oh, oh, I'm controlling it. Oh, well, I mean, I'm controlling Sonic, but 
thought we were supposed to. Oh boy. Oh god. What happened here? Oh my god, are those Chow dead? Oh my. Jeez Louise! Fuck to Kel's father, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm like devastated that like all the chow are just dead.